Hey there, and welcome to HD Calcs. I'm Rick, and in this video, we're going to have a look at how we can use the constant E, also known as the natural antilog or Euler's number, on the Sharp EL531 XT calculator. To do that, we'll use the second function key that looks like this, located here, the ln or natural log key with the second function of e to the power of x that looks like this, located here, the positive negative key that looks like this, located here, and the bracket keys that look like this, located here. First, if we just want to get e or Euler's number, we can do e to the power of 1. To do this, we press second function and then the ln key. We now see e with an exponent sign there. If we enter 1 and then press equals, we see we get a result of 2.71828, etc., or the e constant. If we want to do more complex exponents, like say e to the power of 2 plus 3, we need to use our brackets. So to get started, again we go second and then ln, and then we open our brackets with the left bracket, and then enter our 2 plus 3, and then close our brackets. This lets our calculator know that everything inside the brackets is considered the exponent of e. Then we press equals and see we get a result of 148.41315, etc. We can also do negative exponents, like for example e to the power of negative 2. To do this, we go second ln to get our e on the screen, and then we use the positive negative key to place a negative sign in front of our exponent. It's important to use this key and not the subtraction key because that will give you a different result. And then our exponent of 2. So we have a negative 2, press equals, and see we get a result of e to the power of negative 2 is equal to 0 0.13533, etc. All right, I hope this helps, and good luck on those tests out there, everybody.